Vimeo video tutorial how to use Vimeo for beginners hey guys welcome back in this video I will be showing you how you can use Vimeo for your business and more so let's get into it first of all what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to vimeo.com and you will land on this website right here Vimeo is a video sharing and hosting platform that allows you to make, manage, and share your videos and virtual events with your audience. There are different features available on Vimeo such as video marketing, so you'll be able to reach new customers and get your exciting audience excited for your new products. There is employee communication available that allows you to interact with your team. And then there is also video monetization that allows you to create your own subscription and you'll be able to customize your website and much more. So this platform is actually pretty good for a business. If you have a small business or large, you want to grow it, then you should check out Vimeo. So in order to get started, once you get on the website, you can either join for free and there are different plans available as well. To join, it's really easy. All you have to do is just log in with your Google account or you can use your email address. So after the initial sign up or sign in to your Vimeo, this is where you will land. Now you can see this is the main dashboard that we get. So at the top here, we have different options. We have manage video. So this is where all of the videos that I've uploaded, I'll be able to manage them. My library, then we have analytics, sell videos, video school, and more. Then we have resources, of course, features. So in features, we have create. I can create interactive videos, live streams, create videos, um, and then we can create online courses, uh, create uh, different videos for our business and more. Then we have manage where I'll be able to kind of like go for my video library. We have the video hosting here and privacy options. In order to grow your business, there are different plans and webinars that you can go for and also video monetization is available so once you get to Vimeo at the top here we have upload record create and event so if you want to upload a video that you have already created using another platform you can use this option click on upload and it will allow you to upload a video from your computer you can get a video from Google Drive or any other platform you have so you can see here upload your video choose a file so this is pretty simple I will just Choose a file from my computer. Let's say I have this video right here and I want to actually create this, you know, educational videos and I want to create a subscription. So I will upload this one. Once you upload a video, then we can actually, you know, change it. We can change the settings and the contents. Uploading 87% done and optimization. Okay, perfect. So you can see it was a small video, so it's already uploaded. The quality of the video looks pretty good. And this is the name. We can change the name first. Here it is. So we'll change the name of the video here. And then you can see we have sharing. In sharing, we have a link. We can allow downloads for this video right here on uh, Vimeo. Then we have link, passwords. If you want to go for a public video, so this one is going to be a public video. Then at this side, we have the content option, comments and analytics. So it will give me all of the information about the video that I will upload. And this is going to be like a video, educational video, maybe a course, maybe a video for my business, anything you want to do. So at the top, we have the uh, public uh, privacy option and this is the link. I can also share the link of this video now and then we have the embed option and I can embed it to a website and it will take us to Vimeo here where we have actually uploaded the video. So this is the default upload options. Then we also have the captions and settings. Once you're done with the video, you can actually just click on the public option, click on done, scroll down here, you can see embed again. So all of these options, these three dots, click here and we have publish to socials as well, replace video, add to showcase or even send file or delete video. So this is how you will upload a video on Vimeo. The next option is record. So click on record and it allows you to actually record a video. So here you can open the Vimeo record and use your camera and use your microphone. Click on allow and now it will start recording with your camera and with your microphone. So now it's recording here and you can open up the record. Now uh, we'll actually turn off the camera here. Okay, camera off 
and we have our default microphone and you can check these lines and it's showing me how it looks screen camera or both so this is how we can record i will be just recording this screen so this is the screen recorder that we're getting with vimeo uh, just screen or you want to use just your camera or you want to use both so there's like a picture of you at the side and then there's screen i'll just go with the screen click on start recording and now you can see this is what uh, is being recorded. So it'll record it. And this is how we create videos with Vimeo. Next is create. Click on create to edit a video or to create a video from scratch. So here we have all of our different videos that we can create, add videos. And this is kind of like the editor of Vimeo. At the top, we have templates available, video types. Now check this out. We can create a lot of different types of videos within Vimeo. We have socials, in socials, all of the different platforms. We can even create TikTok videos with Vimeo. Marketing. In marketing, we will be able to create ads product review videos, tutorials, marketing videos, video overlays, and more. In industry, you can choose any industry from here. Then we have businesses, training videos, Shopify, all of these different platforms, and even seasonal videos. In order to uh, use a template with Vimeo, what we do is we'll just select from here. You can see uh, we can get a preview of what a video looks like. Now, this is like a landscape video with the text. The video is looking actually pretty good. Click on customize and it, it takes you to a Vimeo editor that allows you to edit any kind of video you want to. So this works as an editor. We checked out how we can record a video with Vimeo. Then we can upload a video and then we can create something. We can edit a video with Vimeo really easily. So this is our editor. You can see this is the template video that we selected. It has different scenes. We got six scenes here and I can add a new scene from here. At this side of the screen, we have our media. In media, we can upload videos. We have stock media available, Google Photos, and videos. Then we have different presets. Now, preset is something uh, to kind of like go for. So, for instance, like an intro or outro, and I can just use a preset uh, to create a scene here. So you can choose any preset from here, which makes it very easy for you as a complete beginner. Moving on, we have text, so we can add text to the video, title, headlines, subheadlines, and captions. In graphics, you can add any kind of graphics and stickers to your video, such as like uh, bodies in motion, arrows, we have these stickers, shapes, frames, anything you want to add, you can add to your video. So once you add any of the video or text to your uh, canvas here, you can, of course, edit it out. You can change the layouts, the colors, sizes, timing. You can replace or remove. At the top here, we have the total duration of the video, which is 17.9 uh, seconds. Then we have the guides here and the ratio. Uh, you can also get a preview of the video from here. This is going to be your timeline and all of the scenes that you're editing. For instance, here, I want to edit the text. Click on the text and you'll just add the text. For instance, in my case, I just want to add the word welcome here. And we'll actually make it a little bit bigger. So select the text and, you know, place it here. If I want to change the color of the text, then we can like so. Then we can change the background with the media. Uh, so from media, maybe I can go with... If I have like fashion, uh, I'm in fashion industry, I'll go to fashion and I can select something from here. Or what we can do is we can simply uh, upload our videos. So you can see this is how we edit a scene. I have changed the background video and the text as well. Uh, this way, we'll customize all of the scenes. If you want to add any transitions between the scenes, you can use this plus uh, in between to add a new scene or to add a transition. If you want to delete a scene, click on these three dots, click on delete, and it will be deleted. Uh, once your video is ready, you can get your preview and then click on save uh, so that your video is saved and you have your new video that you will edit and create with Vimeo. This way, you can create social media posts, TikTok videos, Pinterest videos, ads, marketing videos for any kind of industry, business videos that will actually grow your business and get you more audience. The last option we get on Vimeo is the event here. Click on event. You can choose your event type, a live broadcast or a webinar. 
click on create and you'll be able to do different settings and this way you don't need to use a third-party tool to create events or webinars Vimeo got you covered so Vimeo is all in one platform with a lot of different options available for you for marketing and more uh, for your small business and large it is actually a platform that you should definitely check out uh, if you are running a business or if you want to run ads or social media campaigns so yeah guys this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was a big help don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up leave a comment down below turn on bell notification and subscribe to youtube channel